I can hear the first part. Has the president seen the images of federal workers standing in line at food pantries? Certainly, and nobody wants to see that happen, which is why the president put forward a proposal on Saturday that addresses that, that reopens the government, that gives Democrats things that they have said that they've wanted, have, gives Democrats things they claim to care about, yet they're absolutely doing nothing to fix the problem. They're doing nothing to reopen the government, and they're doing nothing to address the national security and humanitarian crisis at our border. So, so, uh, the Speaker's week office without a says paycheck. there has never been an acceptance of the invitation to give the State of the Union address next week, and there's never even been a written response to Pelosi's concerns about security, as in a letter. The United it, States Secret Service and the Department of Homeland Security, who uh, would have jurisdiction over whether or not the Capitol is safe for the president to visit, have addressed those concerns. I think they're the most qualified people not only to address it, uh, but to make that assessment. And they've certainly addressed that and I think satisfied those concerns. Blake? Every indication that we're getting is that nothing is going to pass out of the Senate tomorrow. So if and when that's the case, what happens after that? I think that's a question you should ask Democrats. Why are they not supporting a plan that actually addresses the problem and supporting a plan that actually does things that they claim that they want? There's nothing in there that Democrats haven't supported in the past and that Democrats haven't said that they want to see happen. So the idea that they're playing political games with federal workers, the idea that they're playing political games with the crisis at the border, that's a question you'll have to ask Democrats. Well, I can't I answer for them. Right, the were to pass uh, that extended it till February 8th or thereabouts, uh, and it were, and it did pass, and it were in the president's hands. What would his decision be? Uh -oh. I'm not going to get into hypotheticals. The president has a plan on the table that actually fixes the problem. It doesn't kick it down the road. I think the bigger question you have to ask is to Nancy Pelosi. The president asked her point blank if we reopen the government. At that point, we were talking about a 30-day CR. The president asked her point blank if I sign this and we open the government today, will you support in 30 days? funding for border security, including a wall. And she said no. Um, the president's been clear that that has to be addressed. This is a crisis, and we've got to do something about it. Thanks, guys.